Memorial Day is, of course, all about honoring those who died fighting for our country. That is something local veterans got a chance to do on a recent Honor Flight Bluegrass trip to Washington, D.C. WDRB's Katrina Nickel and Josh Horton take us to the Vietnam Memorial Wall. The day before, you were talking to the guy, and the next day I was helping put him on the helicopter. I was an infantryman, grunt. And uh, it wasn't pretty, okay? I mean, we just did what we had to do. One of the lucky ones to make it home. Just so many names. The 58,000, you don't, you, don't, you, you don't envision how many 58,000 is to see the names all put on the wall. My two brothers, the oldest one is Marine. He died of Agent Orange. And my other brothers, between me and the oldest, he died from Agent Orange. I was over there after they went. I seen my mother, her, her hair went from a beautiful brown to a solid gray within three years. She said that she just couldn't handle any more of it. But right here, Paul Lee Price, Corporal, Marine Corps. Kentucky. A neighbor I grew up with is in the Marine Corps. My brother and him, they went to Vietnam together and uh, my brother's getting off the ship, okay? And he got killed the day he arrived in country. And I was still in high school and I had to go to the funeral. And it just, I'm sorry. It just about killed me. But I had to, I had to go to his funeral and he, he knew he was going to die. He was always the big guy, and we were just a little guy. But I, I loved the guy. He just, just a good friend. Brings back a lot of memories, good and then the bad. Like I said, he was just a close friend and neighbor. We grew up together as kids. And found it right up there. I'm just blown away. I actually got to see it. I saw it on the portable wall, but it's nothing like this to actually see it. If I could climb up on his back, I'd want to touch it, but I can't. Gary Smith. He got killed in Way City on the last day. It was. They went in. They were attacking the Citadel, and, and they, they chased the VC out. It just brings things back, other people. Because I, was, I wasn't in Way City with him. I just found out about him and another guy that I knew, Tommy Hammock. He got killed on the first or second day of Way City. And, uh, it was one of our mortar rounds. War's not perfect. Did what we had to do. Had several people in my platoon were, didn't come back. So I mean, it just shouldn't have happened, but it did. And I'm thankful that it happened and that I'm okay. What a powerful and emotional experience for those veterans. I am so grateful for their service and the sacrifice of their friends that they were honoring in that piece.